But now to Brisbane and uh, Mr. Bob Hawke. Mr. Hawke, could I ask you whether you uh, feel a little embarrassed tonight at the blood that's on your hands? You're not improving, are you? I thought you'd make a better start to the year than that. It's a ridiculous question. You know it's ridiculous. I have no blood on my hands. I was not involved in the uh, discussions that Bill Hayden's fellow leaders had with him. I hope the standard of your questioning improves. Mr Hawke, then how do you expect the electorate to believe that uh, you were not party to the plotting that's been going on for the past if fortnight? It, if, it, if it's a question, Mr Carlton, of the electorate having to believe between your stupidity in such a question as that and my integrity, I have no doubt where their, where their belief will fall. I had no knowledge of any meeting this morning. I had an indication yesterday that perhaps by the end of this week Mr Hayden may make a decision. When I went into that executive this morning, I had no knowledge whatsoever that he was making his decision. Now, Mr Carlton, you can sit there with your silly quizzical face. You've got a reputation right around this country. Yeah, it's looking better still. You've got a reputation for your impertinence, your refusal to accept people at their face value, to try and ridicule the integrity of people. Now, I don't mind my integrity being on the line against yours.